Huh? What are you looking at? Uh, people and their silly games. What's going on, everybody? My name's Chris, and welcome back to another exciting episode of Let's Play uh, Pitfall Lost Expedition. I almost said The Legend of Zelda. Okay, let's head to the native games. Whoa. Wakatuko! Oh, uh, we do have two games we could play here. Uh, I guess we'll play Wakatuko. Wakatuko! I don't know why, but the local natives sure love to beat up Tuko Tukos. And that's okay with me. To win, I gotta score 10 points before time runs out or someone else beats me to it. Hmm. Do I gotta. Oh, it must be easy difficulty first. Do I wanna do this now? You know what? Let's not do this now. Let's unlock everything and then come back. I think that's what I did in my initial let's play as well. But I think that. I think it'll make more sense to do that all in one go instead of. Do them like you know one at a time. Like we'd probably only do that walk of Tuco, and then we'd probably just come back at the end of the let's play, and then do them all. So it makes more sense to just do it all at once. So that time will come. Ah, see things have changed out here. Now we have a renegade native tossing the stink bombs, and there's like wobbly leg native over here just standing his guard, and then yeah, he runs away, <laughs> and then he focuses his attention on me. So screw you, asshole! I will punch you in the buns. Uh, so yeah, there's, there's not as many monkeys out here anymore, so that's good, I guess. Oh. Well, I mean, everyone kind of wins here, right? I mean, the renegades are focused on the monkeys. Let's cause some trouble here. <laughs> I love watching. Whoa! Don't attack me, butts! You butts! See if we do this. Yeah, then the marble monkey goes bad shit, crazy. Oh yeah, she don't like that junk. All right, let's be careful here. I don't want to get too close. I love watch. Oh, does she just run away now? What an asshole! She's not gonna save her all the gorilla friends. What? Oh no. Let's do that. There's only okay. There's only one there. Ha <laughs> ha! Now go get the other one. Don't come after me yet, please. I just want to see you save your friends and family. Yeah. Okay, now let's roll over here before she comes after me. <laughs> uh, so I'm pretty sure those all respond back. So no harm done boing, there. Boing, 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 boing. What are you doing? Going boing. I know that. Then why'd you ask? You're strange, you know. <laughs> You know, life's getting a little complicated. Lay it on me. There's this girl. Keep going. Dr. Love is in the house. Nicole? Oh, great girl. Pet me behind the ears for two hours. She'd be perfect for you. Except, of course, that she thinks you're an idiot. Because you wouldn't talk when you were supposed to. Harry, you can't live your life in the past like that. Since I learned to talk, these guys revere me like a god. Hey, fellas. What's up? <laughs> they look very impressed. And very identical. Aww. It's not they revered you like a god. Well... Not everyone feels comfortable around uh, a god. Poor Quick Claw. See him! Where did he go? Where did he go? <laughs> so, yeah, poor little Quick Claw. And yeah, all the butterflies have returned, although there's no point in collecting them anymore. Uh, yeah, so. I mean, Quick Claw is all talk before. And now, when it really comes down to it, it looks like no one really loves him. He's so ronery. Maybe I'm his only friend he has. Maybe, well, probably Nicole too. Nicole likes him too. Uh, there's an alligator here. Crocodile. I, I forget which one it is now. To the renegade forts. So yeah, the reason why I couldn't go over here before is because of the spike pillars. And the only way to break those is with the shield. When you go to punch a spike, it doesn't feel very good. Ooh, it looks so cool. There's mood lighting. <laughs> and there's more here. A little carefully, there's actually a sleepy native. Yeah! Screw you and your spikes. One thing that happened here before is all this like quicksand here, I fell through it once. As I able to like, let's see if I could actually do it here. 
I was able to like get the camera underneath me and then you could see like the entire world. Well, not the entire world. This like entire, entire area. It was really cool. Of course, it's not going to work now. <laughs> oh, okay, okay, okay. Oh, there's a... An idol down there! I believe there's a shaman in here too somewhere. I don't know if we have access to him or not yet though. Whoa! Watch it, Mr. Pitfall Harry! <laughs> Uh, I like laughing at my own jokes. They're hilarious. Just trust me. They're funny. Alright, so let's head up this, this castle here. This very unstable fort. I don't feel like it was a very good idea. Dang it. I don't feel like it was a very good idea for these guys to build this on freaking quicksand. I mean, could you have chosen a, like a worse place to build? Probably not. Um, I mean, so far this place is sticking up though, so... That, that's kind of shocking, but okay. Um... Alright, uh, there's native over there, or the shaman over there, actually. Whoa, dude! Chill your buns! Chill your buns! Uh, is there any more butt to kick? I mean, besides this guy, this is a very obvious guy! Ah! Uh, hoi -ya. Let's do this. Ah, uh, that opens that. I don't know, that, that leads to the next area. I don't want to go that way quite yet. Perhaps one day. I believe the only way to make this jump is with a heroic dive. Yeah, I do get a timer in the background. Uh huh. I think we need the heroic dive here. Oh! Probably should have taken one though. Some of these explosives look really weird. Maybe they're all the same guy. I think they just have like different hair. Well, maybe not. This guy looks like a little boy. <laughs> Where are you even gonna go? He just, he just disappears forever. Bye! <laughs> Falls into the quicksand and dies immediately. Poor guy. Um, I know there's a spot to jump down to. Is it just over here? Cause I don't, I don't remember exactly how to get to that guy. Oh, it is over here! That's shocking to me, but okay. I'll take it! Let's go into a- oh no! I will- I will punish all you natives for being renegades and crazy. Uh, so this is roll. Roll at weird angles, just press in crazy directions on this control panel. I don't know how the heck we went up, but I'll take it! Hola, <laughs> my I wonder if that's an actual language, that'd be cool. 30 idols, jeez. What should we get? Guess we'll get native notes. Uh, so with these notes, I'll be able to know exactly how many treasures, shaman, and explorers are hidden in each native area. Very handy if I'm planning to find all 100% of the hidden treasures in this region. So yeah, this is a very 100% friendly item, completionist friendly item. So there's that. So let's take a look at our map and see exactly what that does. So let's start off actually by looking in the jungle here, because we got the native notes, right? Uh, if we press A to select something like the crash site, it'll say idols, one out of question mark. Explorers, one out of question mark. Shaman, question, question, question. Now, if we go to somewhere we got the notes, like the native territories, for example, we'll open it up and it'll say idols, one out of one. Explorers, one out of one. Shaman, gone away. And what that will also do is that'll tell you, oh, see, the shaman is waiting, telling me that there's a shaman there. And then, um, so, yeah. And it tells you, like, the shaman's way. If there is no shaman, it will tell you, like, no shaman in this area. Never here, see? Okay, so, yeah, that's how that works. Probably not the most useful to me, because I know this game pretty well, but at the same time, it'll be nice Whoa. having that as a backup in case I do get lost and I'm unsure where to go. To the flooded cave. This isn't the way we need to go, and I'm not entirely sure where this leads, but let's find. How do you. Wait, how do you. It's why, is it not? How do you dive? Oh, it is Y. Okay, I saw it pop up there. So I believe this is actually kind of a longer cave. Uh, see, there's like jars and stuff on the ground. Ancient jars! R. Do you, do you go down here? Aha, there we go. So of course, there's nothing ever in these places. No shamans, no oh, eels. No shamans, no idols, no explorers. Oh, good lord. Okay, well, that's what happens when you get electrocuted, I guess. <laughs> Which kind of scared me. I was expecting like, oh, piranhas! Thankfully, they're not as interested in pursuing you down here. Which is interesting, because I, I don't imagine there's too much food down here for them. 
Like, they do eat meat, right? And I don't feel like this is a closed off cave, so. Whoa, jeez, I'm gonna die! Ah, no! Oh, those don't actually take off damage from you, they just stop you in your tracks. Ah, to Bittenbinder's Camp. Bittenbinder's Camp, what? <laughs> Didn't see that coming, did you? <laughs> ah, I see. We're in Bittenbinder. This is, we're on the other side of these plant this noxious things, if you guys remember about where that is. Bittenbinder's right over there. You can't really see them from this area. I think you kind of see. No, that's just a flower. Yep, so now I have to head back. Um, I guess I'll cut out the trip. There's no real point. Well, you know what? Let's stick around, shall we? I'm sure you guys will find this great entertainment. 8 out of 8, mate. Probably won't take as long because I'm not going to hit as many things. I hope. Why was there no eels there? Why are there no eels? What? Oh, there are some eels. Was there an eel right near the end there? Weird. But okay, I'll take it. Oh, yeah. Take a look at this. There's a hand. There's like one of these ancient statues down here. I didn't get a good look at that. I do want to see that, though. Take a look. There's a hand pointing directly up. I love it. <laughs> it's, such a, it's a funny way of kind of telling you where to go by putting one of these ancient statues here. Yeah, we actually exit through. Oh, good lord. Oh, no. I might die here. Oh, no. Oh, no, no, no. Oh, no. That thing give me air. Oh, no. I'm going to totally die. Oh, I died right at the end. Okay, well, I think that's the only- I think that's the first time I ever drowned ever playing this game. That does- that is not a familiar sight to me. See you guys in a second. Alright, uh, uh- Oh, good lord! That was not the kind of welcome I was expecting. That's not a red carpet welcome. That's not a red carpet welcome! Okay, since we left there, yeah, pretty dang sure all these guys respawned, did, 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 and they totally did. How very unfortunate for me. <sighs> uh, I guess we'll just kill the ones in the path here. I'm not gonna walk around country and killing them all again. Oh! Ah, uh, no, no, no! Oh, okay. I'm just happy to knock me down. I don't care about the extra health. Keep it out, dude! I'm getting kinda low, though. Alright, now I'll try this for wheelsies this time, Zs. Oh, oh, we don't gotta watch a cutscene again. Okay. I almost feel like that's racist to like try and imitate their voice! Oh, very easy mistake. Ah, oh, very easy, very easy and doobably. Alright, I'll try that again. The only thing we could do. Alright, here we go again. Woo! Alright. Freaking die for this! Huh. Oh, and look, we actually made it over here while this gate is still lifting up. To the Renegade Headquarters. Sure, why not? <laughs> oh boy, maybe not a good idea. We're at the end of the episode here. The Renegade Headquarters. There's so many heads and quarters here. Uh, yeah, I guess this is as good a spot as any to call it quits. Let's take a look at our notes! Our journal! One entry. Oh man, I can't just. Okay, there we go. Entry 14, January 25th, 1935, 1 32 p.m. Found Quicklaw again, but this time he wasn't his normal, fun loving self. He admitted he really liked Nicole, thought she was great. Don't know what he sees in her, though. But it seems he's on the outs with his fellow Jaguars, and he's been really bummed out about it. There's definitely more to him than meets the eye. He's a Transformer. But then. But then he is a talking Jaguar, so that's kind of to be expected, I suppose. No time to worry about melancholy cats now, though. Continuing south into the renegade native country. Country. I said that with a weird accent there. Country. Uh, nothing. Wait, oh, we, I don't think we read the shield, did we? Oh, I think we did, actually. Yeah. Um, we didn't get any hero can book stuff. Nothing to be scary. Native games. Okay, this, Okay. So that, now that we've played the native games, it tells us about it here. However, uh, that doesn't really, it just says what we already see in the native games anyway. So, we'll read all those once we actually go to play the native games when we have all the items. Oh, I'm blind. I don't know where I'm going. I don't know where to reach for. I don't know. That just looks like something a blind person would do, right? <laughs> Is that insensitive for me to say? Maybe. 
Uh, thank you guys so much for watching this episode. If you enjoyed, I would really like it if you left a like and subscribe. Um, leaving likes really helps out my channel, and if you would like to be supportive of me, leave a like and subscribe. <laughs> thank you guys so much for watching. Um, yeah. Till next time, I'll talk to you guys later. Bye bye. I'm trying to like do like a link shield thing where like you know you put your shield up and you lean down, but it didn't work. <laughs> See you guys later, bye! My friends! My friends!